Good morning. I'm coming to you from the car closet and I'm coming to give you words of encouragement and hope that will bless your lives and your children's lives. And today's prayer, I want it to be a tribute to mothers, to mothers. So the word I pulled out is going to be mother. And so I have a little chart I created of the word mother. All right. And the M we're going to go with mentor, mentor. And so our mothers mentor us. They counsel us with wisdom. They give us guidance. So they become our mentors, whether we're um, from a child on up to adulthood, they still are our mentors. The O we're going to go with overcome. Overcome. And they've had to overcome a lot, a lot of trials and tribulations. There's a lot that our mothers have had to go through, a lot that we may not even know about, but they overcome. They overcame it. Okay, the T, we're going to go with teach. Teach. And in teach, our mothers teach us right from wrong. They t she teaches us, um, have taught us right from wrong. Okay. The H, we're going to go with honor. Honor. Okay, we're to honor our mothers. Right? Honor our mothers. Why? Because I have here, they stick, stay, and they sacrifice. And so sacrifice, our mothers have made a lot of sacrifices for us. And a lot of times, mothers are not going to tell you the sacrifices that they made for you, but they made them nonetheless. Why? Because that's the love that they have for us as their children, whether we're young, teenagers, or grown. Those are the sacrifices that mothers make. And sometimes you don't know it until you not become a mother, and then you have to have made sacrifices for your children. And so the E, we're going to go with eyes. We're going with eyes. Eyes, why? Because her eyes can see what yours cannot see. And a lot of times we can't we can't see things. And so that's when that's when it's called mother's wit. Okay, because your parent, for the most part, they see, okay, my son or my daughter going down the wrong road. Let me try to steer them in the right direction. So what they do is they find ways of how they know how, you know, to tell you to try to steer you back in the right direction and then sometimes even when we become grown we feel well i'm grown i can make my own decisions but even still sometimes they see what you don't see so we thank god for our mother's eyes and that they have that mother's wit because they get that inkling you bring the wrong person home that's not the one and they'll tell you and you can go ahead on now and then okay when we've done that and we've we've followed and we've listened and went our own way and then it was disastrous in the end Right. So we had to come back and say, OK, you know, you was right about that. One. All right. So the R we're going to go with rebuke. Rebuke. And why are we going to rebuke? Because a lot of times parents have to rebuke us. They have to tell us, you know, when we're wrong. No one wants to hear when they're wrong. But if you wrong as your parent, they 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 tell you. OK, so your parent, your your on um, the rebuke is they correct us when we're wrong right? Because no one's always right. So when you're wrong, you need those people around you. See, I don't need you around me to just tell me, okay, this is what you're doing is right. You're not helping me. That's not helping me to grow. I need those people in my corner to say, okay, Laverne, this right here, you need to check this, right? So I thank God for mothers, right? Thank God for mothers and other people that have mothered us. So I'm going to put this over here. We're going to go forth in prayer. So the tribute today is to mothers, to mothers. Let us pray. Who can find a virtuous woman? Her price is far above rubies. Lord, we thank you, oh God, right now for our mothers. We praise you, Lord God, for giving us mothers to teach us. We thank you, Lord God, and we bless you, Lord God, for giving us mothers to guide us and to give us wisdom, Lord God, and to steer us on the right path, Lord path, Lord God, to nurture us, Lord God, even Father God, when we don't like it, Lord God, that they've corrected us, Lord God, and given us proper correction and given us, taught us sound doctrine and sound wisdom, Lord, we thank you, Lord God, that they brought us up in the admonition and nurture of you, Lord. 
Lord. We thank you, oh Father God, even for people that had to step in, Lord God, that took the role of mothers, Lord God, that wasn't our mother, but took the role of mothers. So we thank you for grandmothers, and we thank you for other women in the community that stepped up to the plate and operated in the role of a mother. You understood, Lord God, that this role was so key. You understood that this role was important, Lord. It was to give us our teaching, and it was to give us our, our wisdom, Lord God, and it was to give us the tools that we need so that we would be able to walk on this life. So we praise you right now for our mothers. We thank you, oh Jesus, for our mothers. We pray that you will protect our mothers, Lord God, that no hurt, no harm will come upon our mothers. We pray that we will respect our mothers. We pray that we will honor our mothers, Lord. Forgive us when we've been foolish children, Lord God, and didn't act wise, Lord. Forgive us when we've been, when we've been the grief of our mother. Be a son, be a daughter. Forgive us when we've been the grief of our mother. Lord, we just pray right now in the name of Jesus that we will hearken unto their voice, Lord, that we will look at their mother's wit, Lord God, and we will use it, Father God, to help us and guide us on the path that you have on us, have on us right now called life. So we just thank you right now for our mothers. We pray, Father God, for those who have, who don't, who have lost their mothers. I pray, Lord God, right now in the name of Jesus, that they will go forth and what in her teachings, that they will go forth making their mother proud, Lord God, whether she's here, whether she's not. Lord, we just pray right now in the name of Jesus that our mothers, Lord God, will be our example, Lord God, for us to follow, Lord God, be a good, bad, or indifferent, Lord. We will learn from the good, the bad, and the ugly, Lord, but we praise God today for our mothers. We give you glory, we give you honor, and we give you thanks in Jesus' name for our mothers. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. Amen.